Hey guys, it's The Cooking Company, and I just got back from my Sunday pre-release party. And look what I got. That's right. An empty booster box. <laughs> oh, look, it's got a DS. Um, a card. Bunch of, oh yeah, I bought these pink sleeves because I forgot to bring some of my own. Here are some extra cards. I think that was someone else's. A whole bunch of cards. In pink sleeves. I wish they were purple. Receipt. Aha! My first deck. I ran a... Oh, well, today's format was... I forget. Sealed, limited, whatever. We bought six, um, we bought three Scars of Meriden and three New Phyrexia. And I made this mono black deck because of these cards I will show you. I just wanted to try them out. Oh, here it is. It is called Life's Finale. Sorcery rare card. Destroy all creatures and search target opponent's library for up to three creature cards. Put them into his or her graveyard. Then that player shuffles his or her library. Pretty nice, pretty nice. I mean, it's not all that great, but that's the one I thought was great. So I made this mono deck for it. Because I could not make up my mind. I got two of these um, dark steel axes. Oh, this card's nice too. The Icar Explosion. Um, you sacrifice a creature, um, and you, all creatures get minus X, X, where X is the power of that sacrificed creature. So, they all die. Needless to say, I bought my first little round one with this mono black, and I beat up the guy pretty quickly in, like, three turns. I completely had him poisoned out because of that, uh, the stinger. You know, the guy, he's a 1-1 one, one inflect flyer. I just pumped him up with a couple of those axes and the little thing and just poisoned him to death in about three turns. And... Then on the second round, I got on the buy. So, I took my time and made a better deck. This one's three colors. Because you know how I am, I always freak out whenever we're having, um, like that mono black deck, I didn't even build it until we had 10 minutes left until the round one started. That's how freaked out I get. Like I was just staring at my cards. So I made this a uh, blue, green, and white deck. It's basically, half the cards are um, army builders. I build the, I have a bunch of splicers and um, some mers. So, and I, the rest is a uh, health making. I forget what that's called, but you know, a bunch of cards that give me like a bunch of health. So, when I fought someone on the third round, I completely won that round. I won 2 0 on that one. Oh, is that it? Oh, and here's just extra. So, I'll show you the promo. It's just another Shilgit Whispering one. So my, I ended up with the score of two wins, two losses, and I won a booster pack free of charge. Yay! This is the first time I ever won anything on Friday Night Magic or a pre-release party or anything like that. This is my one mythic that I drew. It sucks. It really, really sucks. Molten, core, molten Tail Master Core. That did not go into my deck. Maybe someone can make it work, but that someone is not me at this point in time. That's like too much thinking to do right there. Here's the uh, promo. Same one I showed you yesterday, Shildred Whispering one. Swamp Walk 6-6. Six, six. You know, Mythic. Here's another one of my rare cards I didn't put into my deck. Surgical Extraction. Yeah, I just couldn't be bothered to figure out. I mean, I'm just thinking these people probably don't have four of each card, so that's probably not too good to use right now. All right, got this sexy chick with the horns again. New Phyrexia booster pack.
All right, here we go. Defensive Stance. Victorious Destruction. Glistener Elf. Blinding Soul Eater. Mortis Dogs. Volt Charge. Parasitic Implant. Trespassing Soul Eater. Shriek Raptor. Ooh, I'm gonna like that one. Blighted Agent. Do Respect. Dark Steel Relic. Beast Within. Omen Machine. That's the rare. Omen Machine. Let's see, players can't draw cards. Uh, at the beginning of the player's draw step, the player exiles the top card. Blah, blah, blah. Golem and Island. Aw, oh, no foil. Well, at least I got the double foil in the Pokemon pack, so that still counts. Alright. Yeah, I bought Pokemon. Because these cards come with... A code card. This card gives you access to the beta test for the Pokemon TCG Online. Not all of them come with it, yet they have to be specially marked boxes. I think you can get it at Toys R Us, you know, but I think he said not Walmart. I don't know, just make sure it says so, otherwise you're not getting it. Because the booster boxes, uh, the booster packs I got from Victini Box did not come with the secret code, but these do. And so the guy at the comic book store, he bought like 10 booster packs. And I'm like, you play Pokemon? The judge from Magic. And he's just like... No, man, I just do it on online, so I need these codes. And I'm like, wow. And then later, he's like, oh, I feel left out because he's the judge. He's not, you know, opening boosters with us. So he started opening his Pokemon cards and pulled a freaking Zekrom full art card. The foil. And he's like, what is this? And then we're just like, oh, my God. Oh, my God, dude. I'll trade you for my Pikachu. He's like, I don't even know Pikachu. So I'm just going to see what's inside. Oh, just if you want to see, it's Reshiram. Reshiram booster pack. I'm interested to see what that secret card looks like. The secret code. Okay, so we have a potion. Oh, right. Oh, look. I think we know which one's the secret one. <laughs> Let's see, should I um, add an extra one? Let's just see if that... I don't know, if it's out of order, who cares? Okay, potion. Sundile. Tepig. Ooh, electric energy. Oh, I think this is the first electric energy I've gotten in a while. Zerua. Basculin. Girder. Full heal. Ooh, foil wachog. Nice and shiny. And look, shiny samurot. Samurot. Okay, so I got two foils and this is my rare. And this is my, oh yeah, don't look at my code, people. My code card. Nice. Oh man, I thought I had more Pokemon cards to open. Now I feel like buying more. 